Top 10 Luxury Cars of 2023 Luxury cars have always symbolized style, class, and extravagance. As we move into 2023, the world of luxury cars is set to get even more exciting, with many new models hitting the market. From sleek sedans to powerful SUVs, the top automakers are gearing up to unveil their latest and most incredible offerings. If you're a fan of high-end automobiles, you will want to watch this Top 10 Luxury Cars of 2023. If you need confirmation that BMW is serious about claiming luxury car supremacy, consider that the i7 and its ICE-powered 7 Series sister will only be offered in leg-stretching, long wheelbase form, while the past six generations of the brand's flagship saloons have focused on driver joy and passenger indulgence. This all-new model is all about five-star comfort and cutting-edge technology. The all-electric i7 is the first to arrive, but regardless of the drivetrain, the large BMW is difficult to see in a crowd. There's plenty of room to stretch out, as you'd expect. And features like the 31.3 BMW theater screen, and features like the 31.3 BMW theater screen for rear seat passengers takes in-car entertainment to the next level. There's also the standard widescreen display in front of the driver, but preserving an iDrive rotary controller ensures a touchscreen interface only partially rules you. The i7 has 536 brake horsepower, a stated range of 367 miles, and a 0 to 62 miles per hour time of 4.7 seconds, thanks to a twin motor setup of a 102 kilowatt hour battery. A curb weight of slightly under 2800 kilograms is less spectacular. With impressive performance and the expected polish and precision in handling, the 7 Series stands out among its predecessors. Enhanced with four-wheel steering for superior agility, it takes luxury to new heights. However, what truly sets the i7 apart is its newfound sense of comfort, surpassing even renowned models like the Range Rover and Mercedes S-Class. The current 7 Series from BMW may have hit it out of the park, but the Mercedes-Benz S-Class remains the default pick for a good reason. It was last remodeled in 2020, with a greater emphasis on digitization than ever before. The inside seems reassuringly classic yet cutting edge, and the breadth of the massive monitors avoids the startling omnipresence in other manufacturers' vehicles. Ambient lighting and connection are exceptionally well accomplished, and underlying it all, except one or two ergonomic inadequacies, sits one of the most tangibly pleasant and cosseting places to sit. At the same time, the miles pass for both driver and passenger. However, the S-Class's gasoline, diesel, and hybrid powertrains are excellent. The lineup changes depending on availability, but you generally have an option between the S350D or S400D diesel or an S500 petrol with mild hybrid assistance. The diesel is pleasingly real-world efficient and smooth, and the S400D provides all the performance that a car of this caliber would ever want, while the S500 offers even faster, but still tranquil and smooth, 400 brake horsepower alternative if you want it. The plug-in petrol-electric S580E has 503 horsepower combined can drive up to 64 miles in electric-only mode, and has a lower corporate vehicle tax charge than the combustion-only variants. The Volvo S9 is a premium vehicle with a Scandinavian flair. It boasts a distinct minimalist style, and a price tag comparable to mid-sized luxury vehicles. Volvo's S9 is an exceptionally stylish car with an inviting interior and a little facelift. Volvo provides a simpler S90 portfolio for the 2023 model year, with the S90 Recharge at the top of the model range. It has a turbocharged electric 2.0-liter inline-four engine that generates 455 horsepower and 523 pound-feet of torque. The hybrid system provides low-end torque, allowing the car to keep its lively, off-the-line feel. The Genesis G80 is the ideal sedan for anybody searching for a luxurious driving experience and cutting-edge technology. It is less expensive than its European counterparts, 
and has a 10-year or 100,000-mile powertrain warranty. With Napa leather upholstery and a 14.5-inch infotainment screen, the Genesis G80's interior is modern and user-friendly. Genesis also provides decently powerful engines, such as the essential 2.5T's 300-horsepower turbocharged 2.5-liter four-cylinder. The GLE is the gold standard for premium crossovers. It provides the same luxury, comfort, and elegance as the E-Class sedan, but with more adaptability and a commanding road perspective. Mercedes-Benz offers several GLE variants, ranging from the entry-level GLE 350 to the track-ready AMG GLE 63S. Regardless of configuration, the GLE stands out immediately because of its elegant LED lighting and stunning appearance. The GLE, like most of its Mercedes stablemates, features a fantastic cabin that spares no expense in its pursuit of perfection. The Audi A8 is the company's biggest sedan, with everything you could want in a high-end luxury car. It has a peaceful and roomy cabin with premium leather upholstery. The A8 has plenty of room for four persons, with the front and rear seats providing excellent comfort. The A8 comes with only one engine choice, a powerful turbocharged 3.0-liter V6 delivers 335 horsepower and 369 pound-feet of torque. Audi also provides the S8, a sportier variant of the A8, with a twin-turbocharged 4.0-liter V8, producing 563 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque for additional power. The fifth-generation Range Rover is a vast cry from the first Range Rover, a somewhat gentrified farm vehicle. It is now a full-fledged luxury vehicle, trading some previous entrance on-road characteristics for incredible off-road capability. It's all new below, with Land Rover's MLA Flex, design, and an 80% aluminum build for lightness and strength. Torsional rigidity is up 50% over the old vehicle. The Range Rover handles with assured accuracy and startling agility thanks to precisely tuned-in air suspension, 48V active anti-roll bars, and the possibility of four-wheel steering. It's also whisper-quiet on the road, offering a luxurious ride that steamrolls rugged terrain. The plug-in hybrid Range Rover P440e and Range Rover P510e. Models provide up to 70 miles of electric-only range, resulting in an 8% corporate car tax for fleet operations. The Range Rover P530 can reach 62 miles per hour from a standstill in 4.4 seconds. Consider your ideal driver's vehicle. You're probably picturing something compact and lightweight with just enough power and grip. The Bentley Continental GT V8 possesses none of these characteristics. According to Bentley, the Continental GT V8 has a curb weight of 4,773 pounds. It boasts over 500 horsepower and can easily convert that power into speed. The inside is lavishly finished with a farm's worth of leather and massive slabs of lacquered wood. Lotus creator Colin Chapman's disciples, he who advocated, simplify, then add lightness, would weep at sight. The Bentley Continental GT is based off the same architecture as the Porsche Panamera. However, it is somewhat shorter and broader. It has the same 4.0-liter twin-turbo engine as the Panamera Turbo in the V8 version. From 1960 to 4500 RPM, it produces 542 horsepower and 568 pound-feet of torque. With a red line of 6800 RPM, it is the highest revving engine ever installed in a Bentley. The Panamera is not only a genuine Porsche sedan, but also one of the top performance sedans on the market. Depending on the model, it's easy to forget you're not in a Porsche. The 325 horsepower twin turbocharged V6 engine in the basic model is enough. Porsche also sells the Panamera Turbo. It combines outstanding performance with excellent comfort. Porsche updates and redesigns its vehicles with each model year, 
The most recent model boasts performance with a snappy twin-turbocharged 4.0-liter V8, producing 620 horsepower and 604 pound-feet of torque. Although electric automobiles were popular in the early 20th century, Rolls-Royce has just produced one today. The first is the Spectre, an ultra-luxury coupe that replaces the aging Phantom Coupe. It marks the beginning of a new era for Rolls-Royce. With plans to go all-electric by 2030, the battery pack is built into Spectre's extruded aluminum space frame, and while Rolls-Royce doesn't specify the energy capacity, it does state that the battery pack weighs more than 1,500 pounds. The specifications have yet to be finalized, but Rolls-Royce claims that the electric powertrain will produce 577 horsepower and 664 pound-feet of torque. Its entire length of 214.685 inches is nearly as long as a Mercedes S-Class with a long wheelbase, weighing 6,559 pounds. Despite this, it accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.4 seconds, and has a peak speed of 155 miles per hour. With each passing year, the automotive industry surprises us with the ability to create even more extraordinary vehicles. So, which one of these luxurious marvels captured your imagination the most? Let us know in the comments below. Until next time, goodbye.